welcome this is the financial business um, reading for the cancer sun moon and rising sign for the month of January wow cancers 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 okay my darlings all right your end of the month um, in business with a big bang okay so business people are ending the month with a big bang um, people on the work floor are having really to find inner strength end in the month so let's go in and check this out so what I'm seeing is that the seven of uh, disc is here the seven of this some of you are dealing with a Virgo okay some of you are dealing with a young Virgo now whatever the issue is um dealing with this young Virgo on the work floor um, this young Virgo has a whole lot of potential and you cancers are definitely going to see that whoever this young Virgo is, they have a whole lot of potential. So this Virgo is going to be helping you because they're very good at what they do. And I see you're really you're really taken back with this Virgo because they're they're very quick on their feet so um, that is going to be very good some of you could have take this person on this um, as your assistant or as your your secretary or your personal assistant, and you're really seeing it could be someone for a different department but whoever this person is they're very good and they're on their feet in business business is looking good I'm seeing growth in your business there's a lot of growth that is coming up in your business whatever is transpiring I see the potential of growth is going to be very very good because I see that um, whatever has been stuntering or um, there was no growth in 2019 I see you starting this year is as if you're changing up things and I see growth is coming in your business so that is good some of you are dealing with an Aries Lee or a Sagittarius person you're very disappointed in this person whoever this person is um, this person could be head of a department or this person was working in personnel so, um, personnel the personnel officer but whoever this person is it could be a notorious a legal in the legalities of so and um, you're not really happy with this person you're very disappointed with this person so however this person comes up I see real disappointment is coming to you with this person there's another person that you're disappointed with and is an Aries uh, uh, Leo or Sagittarius and this is a young man this could be someone you have partnered up with or it was someone and this person is coming up as an ophiosis of or Sagittarius now whatever has transpired whoever this person is this uh, this man is between the ages of 25 and 50 whoever this person is I see you're ending a cycle with this person so I see a tower moment is coming down for this person. You're ending a cycle, and there's a tower moment coming down for this person. Because whatever the issue is and the situation is, I see that uh, this person has cost you a lot because uh, um, this person has um, pushed you down the wrong rabbit hole, and it is now coming up because in the third week, you're going to be finding out what this person has done. This person. Oh, they're not showing up so they're fire sign people because they're not really showing up who they are they could be Ophiosus or, or Sagittarius but I see that some of you this could be someone who you're ending a cycle with okay a period has ended this karmatic relationship um, on the work floor or in business is being ended with this person the six the six of uh, um, swords is the end to a cycle and you're finding strength to move on because you are um, you're really surprised at what uh, this person have done and you're you're like these two people have created so much and this is a karmatic situation because the wheel of fortune is here and it is no luck this wheel of fortune with a tower 
meaning that these two people have um, taken you down a rabbit hole. Okay, so whoever these people are, they're definitely coming up in the business world and they're coming up in the work life. Okay, and they have took you down a rabbit hole and I'm seeing because here you are really interested in this uh, um, um, Virgo because this Virgo or this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person that is coming in is really good at what they do. It's coming up as a Virgo for some, but it's it can be a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. They're very good at what they do. But this little cycle here is huge disappointment because you're going to be finding out what these people have done. And you are going to um, take down this young lady this woman, I see you ripping and really shattering her world. And this person, I see you're just going to say, um, you know, it's not working out. Um, you know, it's better for you to, you know, move on or find something new because you are going to be finding out what these people have done. Because I see you here in the fourth week making a decision to end up a, 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 a period with this person and you're trying to find inner strength to move on because you realize and you have have come and to realize what these two people have done together now however these people are coming up they're both coming up in the business um world and they're coming up um in uh they're coming up in the business world but they're also coming up in the work floor okay so it could be you and let's say that this is a another person this could be a friend but also um the manager of another department and i see you ending it you're so disappointed in these two people disappoint you're so extremely disappointed in these two people so influence i see some influence is coming here and as i have said a virgo this is definitely a virgo um a person that is coming up but it it's 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 coming up as a taurus virgo or capricorn but i'm getting the strong feeling of a virgo whoever this person is because we have the influence of the hate of sword I, I you're now seeing that this person had a whole lot of potential and it's as if this person is not there anymore and i see as if this person had a whole lot of um potential what I'm also seeing and realizing is that you're going to be finding out that these two people, this woman, this Aries Leo and Sagittarius woman, and this man, if you notice the disappointed is above her and the disappointed is by this man between the age of 35 and 50. You're very disappointed about these people. However way they're coming up, disappointment and here it is there's a lot of strive and this is coming from a past life and there's so much strive that is going on this is coming from a past life because these two could have been friends working in an organization or working in your company or working on a work a work floor and they have created so much deceptiveness that now you're finding out in the in the second week coming in the third week and you are so surprised at what exactly has transpired is as if some secrets that something that they have done and you're going to be realizing that a Virgo has left the company and it's because of these two you are going to be realizing that a very good worker has left the company and it's because of these two okay another seven is here and this is deceptfulness so cancers you are going to be finding out that this man um it could be oh, this man is very deceptive and this man has been doing some deceptiveness and now it's coming to an end it is it, it's coming to an end it is as if in the second week you found out about what this man has done you have strived with this person this is a karmatic situation and you have strived, and I'm seeing these people coming up as uh, like people, friends you know, and you got them to work in your company, 
and then you realize that they have done some deceptive situation because here is the seven of swords and the seven of swords is lie and deceitfulness and you're going to end that in the fourth week because you're going to say to this person because there's strife between you and this person and you're saying to this person hey um you have to find another job or find another position because i am disappointed in what has transpired and i see a tower moment is coming down for this lady because of this lady you both are now in strife and i see you are going to be ripping this person out of your company or out of your organization because you found out what this person have done i see you're going to be victorious because i see people are going to be happy that they leave okay whatever decision you scorpion does and choose to you cancers um choose to do i see that a lot of people in the company or on the work floor is going to be happy of the decision that was made because a lot of people know that they were creating those two were creating a whole lot of strife against people on the work floor and i see a lot of people are going and if you're a, a director or a boss or so i see a lot of people are going to be saying finally finally they see who has been creating all of these chaos over the work floor and chaos um in situation i see you're not taken back um on this person because you realize how this person has created so many issues for the company that could have caused the company some lawsuit or that sort of a thing and here i see you with this and it's created by this woman this woman is like kind of crazy she's off so this woman could be a lawyer also and you're very disappointed because i see now is when you begin to see exactly in the first week going in the second week you're beginning to see exactly who and what has transpired and i see you ending it in the fourth week is you're saying to the guy i'm sorry but you know our relationship our working relationship and private relationship is no longer working and it is better that you find somewhere else but this woman i see you taking i see you blowing the gullets and the, because you find out the deceptiveness that they have done a lot of people are going to be happy that you make the decision to get rid of these people because they have been creating a whole lot of chaos um within a company or organization and i'm seeing you as the manager or the supervisor or someone that has the proper step to make these decisions and i see you making this decision because you realize the the chaos that they have caused for a department for an an um and um the work floor for your company and how they have brought your company in deep far water and you're going to be victorious you're going to find the strength after you get rid of them because this lady i see you might tear her down so much but this person you're going to end all communication all relationship and you're going to say i'm giving you time so that you can find another job this i did not expect of you and i see the strength finding the inner strength and here what is transpiring is that you're going to be victorious and i see people are going to be saying you know thanks that someone saw what was going on because this thing has been going on for quite some times and look this is the beginning of january and it is also the new year and it's all about the restart button changing um people situation that is creating um um you know chaos in an organization and that is exactly what you're doing now for the rest of you it is really about uh, you know coming out of this month being very very um victorious and finding the inner strength on the work floor to deal with certain issues that you saw came up and finding inner strength and i see people are going to be appreciating what you have done so there we go i'll speak to you next month bye